welcome to another episode of the Tactical 2 Minute Drill, brought to you by the 40 We're going to be looking at the dual optics presented on some firearms. This one is going to be the MK16 or Scar Light, featuring the 5.56 round and with a CQT scope. Uh, which offers a red dot and a high-powered ACOG. The first thing we'll look at is the donut-style ACOG of the MK16 CQT. Uh, with this, it's pretty accurate and pretty reliable out uh, to a couple hundred yards uh, or a couple hundred meters. And uh, it provides a good really accurate shot. You can see by just pressing the slash key on the top of the number pad, we're going to be able to switch in from this particular optics mode to this optics mode. This is ideal for close quarters and targets that may be on the move that you can't necessarily get a good scope on using the standard um, four times. Once you figure call. out where exactly sweet spots for you, uh, you'll be able to address targets that are at a closer distance that you don't necessarily need that four times zoom for. Um, and it also gives you a wider scope and range of what's going on down the field. The last part of the dual optics mode that we're going to talk about today is the plus and minus sign. This is our standard optics mode here with the standard plus and minus field of view. By double tapping the minus key on my number pad, I'm able to push my field of view back farther, see more of the weapon, more of my character, and more of my arms depending on what mode um, that we're in. Likewise, double tapping the plus sign will throw me into a scoped in mode to where I can better assess longer range targets and focus my vision on the battlefield. It is of some note that this optics trick only works with iron sight or red dot optics. It will not have any effect on the A. Thank you for optic. joining this and this episode of the Tactical 2 Minute Drill brought to you by the 42nd Air Assault Regiment.